Hey everybody, welcome back to my YouTube channel and welcome to today's video. So today I'm gonna to be sharing with you everything that I have picked up for my daughter's summer wardrobe. Not only that, but everything I'm gonna show you in today's video is actually from Vinted. So there are a couple of things in there that are new with tags. Um, most other things are used, um, but I will show you in a second. Other than the fact that I'm not having to take the tags off myself, there is absolutely no way you would ever know. So we're gonna jump straight into the video, but before we do that, don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe to my channel if you're not already, and please let me know in the comments if you have used Vinted. I am very, very new to this, and when I say I am impressed, I am not joking. So let's jump into the video and we'll get to all the good stuff. Okay, so like I said in the beginning, I'm very new to Vinted. I've actually had the app for a good few months. Um, a lady, a fellow mummy on my Instagram mentioned it to me because I asked about selling pre-loved because um, I did have an Instagram page that I was selling all of my older two's clothes on. Um, and she said, try Vinted. And I just, I don't know what it is. I just couldn't get into it for whatever reason. It was obviously just me not taking the time to actually fully fall in love with it because I'm not joking when I tell you I've fallen in love with it. Today, I've been on there about six weeks and I've made over 400 pound and I'm not very regular at uploading. There's a few items on there, but I've still got a lot more to upload. So I'm gonna do a whole nother video on that, like what I've made, how I use it. But today I just wanted to show you what I have picked up um, because if you have, been a bit on the fence about using Vinted. I just wanna show you how amazing it is and the like amazing bits you can find. So my daughter is currently six months um, and we're coming in, we're all, obviously in spring, we're gonna be moving into summer. She literally only has about three or four things that I purchased in advance um, for these months. So I knew I needed to get her a bit of a wardrobe together. So everything I'm gonna be showing you is from six months upwards. So we're gonna jump straight in. The first thing I have got um, is a Zara kind of like little romper, beautiful color, and it's in this kind of like linen, linen, um, like what do you call this, like cheesecloth material. It's so stunning, I absolutely love it. As you can see, it has the tags on. So this one is six to nine months. So this is one of the ones she'll be wearing fairly soon if our weather decides to sort itself out. And I think I paid about four pound for it. Now I know it doesn't have the actual price on, but I know in Zara these are about 15 99 And don't get me wrong, I have bought things in Zara, but do you know, I went in with my elder daughter on the weekend. They had some like stunning, like stunning pieces in there. This like play suit thing that I fell in love with for my baby. And I looked at the price and it was 22 99 And you know, I'm obviously a changed woman because I turned around and walked away from it and I was like, I can't pay that for it. I just can't pay it. When I show you what I've bought in a second, I honestly, I just couldn't bring myself to pay the price. I was like, I'm gonna have to go on Vinted and have a look. Um, so yeah, that's the first thing. Absolutely, this is my kind of like bits that I love for Penelope to be in. So I'm in love with that. Next up, so this isn't new, this is actually used. So on Vinted, it has different categories um, for like the condition of the item. So there's very, like there's obviously new with tags, new without tags, very good, which is, you list it as very good if it's got like slight signs of wear, but I only worn a handful of times. And then there's good, satisfactory. This was listed as very good. And like I said at the start, other than me not taking a tag out, you, you wouldn't know that it's not new. So this is actually from Baby Gap. Um, again, it's one of those little romper suits with the open legs. I'm picturing this on a lovely spring day. I know I've been very brave with the color, um, but I just know she's gonna look so beautiful in it. Um, if you can see the detail there and the little thin straps, I'll just give you a bit more of a close up. So again, it's in that linen, linen sort of like cheesecloth material. And I just absolutely love it. You're gonna see a kind of like little squidgy nappy bum in there. And oh, I just love babies in these. Um, and do you know, I think this was one pound 50, one pound 50. You just can't, there's literally not a mark on it. 
like not a mark on it and i haven't washed any of this i've actually brought it down so i can pop it all through a wash um just because obviously i want it to be washed in my kind of like fabric conditioner and washing tabs but yeah love that one and then next up i'll tell you where is very good on there so zara pieces you can find for an absolute steal but also h&m so this is a h&m one they've actually got this on there now because i was having a little look through the app and if it's not this it's very very similar so this is kind of like a romper but this is where it would sit just on the kind of like thigh um it's got the oh, just come a bit closer look at the color of that with the little wooden buttons i just absolutely love it i think this online is 12.99 um which to be honest isn't too bad a price but i got this for two pound so you know that's so much better um and again other than me not taking the tag off i cannot see a mark on it there's no signs of wear there's no bobbling um what size is this one this is nine to twelve months um so yeah i just oh, love it these are my favorite kind of things for her to be in okay now this next item is from zara and i'm actually a bit sad about this one because um it's in the age six to nine i'll just come and show you so it's one of their like knitted um like dungaree play suits so it's kind of like got all the lovely detail on it um, and this is a longer leg one, but quite honestly, I don't think that's going to come anywhere near Penelope. She's got some chunky legs on her, bless her. She loves her milkies, and I'm pretty certain that isn't going to fit her. Um, I don't think the legs are big enough. I'm going to try it, but if not, I'll just pop it back on my vintage. It's like a very, very pale rose pink colour absolutely stunning and this one was four pound so what i tend to find is the knitted pieces on there are just slightly more expensive but i mean four pound i'm pretty sure this is one of the ones it's about 22.99 in zara um so yeah love this wish it was slightly bigger which i find with zara some of their stuff is a bit on the smaller side okay this next piece this is zara again this is six to nine months this is actually very big for size now with this one by me looking at it, i can tell that it's been worn it's not in bad condition at all it's just not as pristine as the other ones if it probably isn't even going to pick up on camera um but again this is probably just me being a little bit picky so on the back um you've got like slight slight bobbling but i mean she's a baby and she's probably going to get food all down it and not stay very clean anyway so it's fine this one was about two pound fifty i think but i just love the little apples on it how cute is that and just beautiful pastel spring colors and this is just a slightly thicker material so it's going to be perfect for the like transition we are in spring but i mean it feels more like winter so with a cardigan on this is going to be perfect for her okay next up i've got another zara piece this one is it looks like six to nine yeah this one's six to nine so again it's a knitted dungaree um and this again you can tell has been worn because of the material a bit it started to go a little bit fluffy nothing horrendous it's still got so much life in it i think i only paid about four pound for this which is an absolute bargain because these again range from anywhere from like 22.99 i think i've even seen them up nearer like 27.99 it's in a really lovely dusky pink it's coming off a little bit brighter on camera um but yeah again this is perfect for now where it's slightly cooler she can wear like a long sleeve top under it but just look at the back how it crosses over if it gets a little bit warmer she could even wear this like on its own with nothing underneath um obviously i can roll the legs up but yeah love that one okay next up this has got to be my favorite item just because the color this is my favorite color at the moment so again there's a bit of a trend going on you'll see for summer it's one of these little rompers where it sits at the top of the legs but look how stunning that detail is you've got the frill around the sleeves my favorite kind of like khaki color it's got the poppers there obviously for nappy changes and then on the back it's got buttons again i wouldn't even know this has been worn what size is this i think it's 9 to 12 
I actually got this, yeah, this is 9 to 12. So I did, I bought a bundle off of a lady. So again, another amazing thing with Vinted. If you sc are scrolling through and you see an item you like, a lot of the time that seller will have multiple things, like I, <laughs> this is me, and you can set kind of like bundle discounts. So it will then take you to that seller's item so you can pop a bundle together. So I bought this and I a few more of the bits that I'm coming up to show you in a minute and I think I got it for about £17 and I'm talking if I would have bought this full price in the shop it would have been like well over £70 so yeah I absolutely love this one this is a next um romper so it's very kind of like Zara vibes I feel like but the colour instantly sold me absolutely love it Okay, I've also got the cutest pair of little linen shorts for her and they've got oranges on them. How stunning. Again, they're in this linen material. These are H&M, so their range in this material is stunning. It's um, obviously similar to those rompers. This is in the size six to nine and I'm planning on pairing this with like a little white vest. So yeah, we're just literally waiting for our weather to warm up. And these are one pound fifty. One pound one pound fifty. I just can't believe how much I've got all of this stuff for. Okay, next up we've got another H&M romper. This is in the size 9 to 12. This is in more of a kind of like muted rose pink. Again, it's got the wooden button, so it's similar to, it's from the same range as this. So when you're on H&M, you can flick through the different colorways, but I love these. I think they look so lovely and they're obviously very lightweight for them. Got the little frill detail there. And again, it sits just above the knees. Um, the back is plain, so um, it buttons all the way down, obviously, for the nappy changes. And I got this in with the bundle with that romper, so I think this was about £3. Um, but yeah, love it. Amazing condition. Can't even see that that's even been worn. Okay, this next item I am picturing if we're on holiday. It's a Zara dress in the size 9 to 12 months. To be honest, this will probably fit her now, because like I said before, Zara aren't particularly generous with their sizes. Um, the detail on this dress is stunning, so stunning. This is an item that I got with the bundle that I was talking about just now, and if I just slowly come up, can you see all of that embroidered detail? Um, and it's like an oatmeal colour, um, it's coming off a bit bright on camera buttons all the way down and the material is so lightweight it's um, like a linen material and it's got kind of like a frill detail there on the sleeve um so yeah absolutely stunning i can just see her with a little bow in her head with this on so cute and then off of the same lady this again was in that bundle it's a zara dress 9 to 12 um, and it's just in this really lovely pink colour. Again, it's that lovely linen, linen material. So the buttons go down there just to pop it on over her head. And it's just so lightweight. Um, again, this will probably fit her nice. So if we do, as we go into May, June time, she'll get lots of use out of this. And obviously I can put some bloomers over her nappy. So I'm sure this will last her through the summer. Love that one. And then <laughs> another thing with these H&M rompers, I just don't think you can go wrong. So this is the full leg version. Um, so again, you've got the buttons all the way down. You've got the little frill detail there on the sleeve. This one's in 9 to 12. It um, has the elastic bottoms. And this time, because it's full leg, you have the poppers there for nappy changes. And I'm pretty sure this was four pounds. So I just love the colour. So as you can see, the kind of like tones I've gone for are very kind of like neutral, um, which I'm loving at the moment. Okay, so I've also picked up a couple of swim suits for her. So what I've found, obviously because the sizing range in babies tends to only be in three month chunks until they get to the 12 month and then it's in a six month bracket. Um, and I don't really want to be paying like 20 odd pounds for a sun safe suit. Um, it's obviously your skin, I need it all to be protected. That she potentially might only wear for three months and she's probably not going to be in it very long. So I had a look on Vinted and I found some bargains. So first up, this is for this summer, so it's a 9 to 12. It's a sun safe suit, but it's actually in a two piece. So it comes with the little pants to go over her nappy with the frill detail on. How cute is that? 
and then the long sleeve top so this i love because it does actually keep them cool even though it's got long sleeves um but obviously it just protect her against the sun so if we go away this is the sort of thing i'll pop her in obviously if we're in the garden she can wear this as well um when the kids have the pull up and this was three pounds um i mean other than again it not having a tag there's literally no stings or anything on it so yeah absolute bargain um I have ordered her another swimming costume which hasn't arrived. I was hoping it would be here for this haul, um, but it hasn't arrived. I'll see if I can insert a picture here. It is this beautiful costume from H&M and I absolutely, as soon as I saw it, I thought I have to have that. Um, so yeah, that should be here any day now. And then I have actually purchased one for next summer for her because we do have a holiday booked for next year, um, next summer so this is in the size did i get i think i can find the tag so yeah this is in the size 18 to 24 months so one and a half to two years and it's actually just a sewing costume the reason i pre-bought this is because it was one pound 50 and i bought it with that bundle with the dresses and it's a next one next swimming suits baby grows they just wash amazing um it's not quite as bright as it is coming off on camera but look at the sleeves and the best part is the back i cannot even take how cute that is so yeah that is going away for next year £1.50. Okay guys that's everything that I bought my daughter from Vinted for her summer 22 wardrobe. I really hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you found it useful. I hope it showed you some of the amazing pieces that you can find even if they're pre-loved. There's nothing wrong with that. Like I said I'm going to go and pop all of this in the wash now. Um, and other than a couple of the rompers that have got slight bobbling, nothing major. I mean it would probably happen as Penelope wears it anyway. You wouldn't know that it's not new. I mean, babies are in things for such a short amount of time. Um, I wish I would have done this with my other two, really. I've saved myself an absolute fortune. I don't think I've spent any more. If I say £50, that's being generous, because I don't even think all of this come to £50, and I've pretty much got her entire summer wardrobe sorted. And then when I'm done with it, I'm going to pop it all back on Vinted. So I do have a Vinted account. It's always linked in my description bar. There's pieces from me, some of my maternity pieces. I've got some of Tom's bits on there, Darcy and Ollie's pieces. Um, Ollie certainly, because obviously I'm not going to be having any more children. So I am going through Ollie's gradually and uploading that. And I, what I'm doing with Darcy's is I'm just keep looking at the things I want to keep keeping that aside for Penelope and then everything that I want to sell on I'm just popping on my vintage and like I said today I've made over 400 pound I could not be happier I was going to show you um like a clip of how it works in case you're new and you were just curious but I just thought this video would be a bit too long um because I like to ramble uh so I am going to do another video so give me a thumbs up if you want me to film that for you what I was thinking is like a how to upload things to look out for tips and tricks and how to use because there's different things you can do like different filters um different things you can look for so I was planning on filming that as a separate video so stay tuned for that um, but don't forget to give the video a thumbs up, leave me a comment in the description, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye everyone. I don't really need new friends, so spend your time with me. Looking for someone who can play though, wanna hang with me. I'm not really looking for a friend, so spend your time with me. Looking for someone.